mop with. Bilang isang aktor, aktor at guru, malaki ang kontribusyon ni Antonio Omabesa sa pag-unlad ng sining ng dulaan sa Pilipinas. Yes. Chairperson Margarita Moran Floirendo, the CCP Board of Trustees, the NCCA Commissioners, Chairman Arsenio Niclizazo and his representatives, living national artists, distinguished guests, dear friends, magandang gabi po sa inyong lahat. Words cannot express the joy we the family of national artist Antonio Mabesa feel at this moment for the honor that you have conferred on our dear Uncle Tony. Pamangkin po ako, hindi po ako kapatid. Just to speak for the family, how I wish I knew what he wanted to say to you today. But I will try my best. So forgive me if I miss on some things. To the Filipino people and the Office of the President for conferring this honor on my uncle. To the NCCA Board of Commissioners, the CCP Board of Trustees, the Council of Experts, the Jury of Experts, the Researchers, the Living National Artists, and those who nominated Sir Tony for the Order of National Artists, thank you. Thank you for the hard work you have poured into this. Growing up, I was a witness to his love affair with theater. He lived and breathed theater and was the greatest storyteller I know, both on stage and when he was with his family. I know that he would want he would have wanted to thank his parents who supported his decision to study theater in the United States after finishing a degree in agriculture. <laughs> his friends in UPLD who were part of the many plays he staged there. This was where all it began. His brats from Upsilon, Sigma Phi fraternity. His mentor. National artist, the late national artist Wilfrido Maria Guerrero who inspired him to pursue his dream. His immediate family, Tita Jackie and David, who allowed him to spread his wings and contribute immensely 
to theater education and theater in the Philippines. His colleagues in theater, from the theater, whom he worked with, acted with, and directed, some of whom have become national artists themselves, and some of them are with us here today. The UP Department of Speech Communication and Theater Arts who gave him the freedom to develop their theater arts program, formed the Dulaang UP and eventually the UP Play Playwrights Theater and much, much more. Conchita Sumiko, who gave him the opportunity to become the theater director of the Manila Metropolitan Theater that showcased Filipino works and translations. The Aguilas University Foundation for naming him its artistic director for their company. This allowed him to reach more people, a new generation, igniting their passion for the theater. His countless dear, dear students, many of them have carved their own names in theater, film, and television, both here and abroad. He was very proud of all of them. A lot of them became his close friends, his extended family, his theater family, and a lot of them are here today. They are the reason why I am here today, thanking all of you for this honor. Their tenacity and fervor paved the way for this moment. They continue to be living witnesses of Sir Tony's contribution to the country and theater. The lion of the theater, Tony Mabesa, lives on in each and every one of them. They will continue his legacy. In behalf of my cousin, David, and the Mabesa family, with humble, humble hearts, please accept our deepest gratitude for this honor. To God be the glory. Maraming salamat. <laughs>